morning, Northland. I'm Grace. And I'm Mariana. And you're watching Northland Christian News. News. We hope you had an amazing Labor Day weekend. Mayor, what did you do this weekend? Well, I hung out with friends and may or may not have watched all 31 seasons of Mr. Rogers Neighborhood. Nice. Yeah, what about you? Well, I actually got to go to Disney World, so. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> and now for all the board game nerds out there. This Saturday, September 12th, is the first annual Midwest Dice Masters Open. If you guys are interested in attending, please meet Mr. Callan today in the music room at lunch. Next on NCN, we got to catch up with some of our soccer guys. And next week, we'll catch up with a few of the volleyball girls. All right, so let's go see what the guys had to say about the season. Let's see, well, team goals would probably be trying to get a positive goal differential. I know last year that was really hard for us because we can never really score goals, but you know, I'd like to score a couple this year, at least be involved in the attacking formation and what we do. Well. One of our goals is to have a winning season. And another is to go undefeated at home. Four shutouts. More than 25 goals. And to win at least one postseason game. Well, being in a new conference, we'll be playing different teams than that we normally do not play. For me personally, it's definitely to step up and be a leader as a team and encourage the players. Try to always be positive. I know we have some inexperienced players this year, you know, on the lineup possibly. So, you know, just encourage them, coach them, you know, be honorable to my coaches and play hard. One thing I'm looking forward to is chilling with the boys. I'm looking forward to scoring goals. For me personally, it's have fun. You know, last year I kind of focused on it, taking it a little too seriously. Uh, you know, as a team, kind of mess around, bond with them, play with them, play hard, obviously, every game. But, you know, to have fun and really enjoy the game. Because this is my last year, and so I really hope to enjoy it and, you know, have a good time with the coaches. Enjoy the coaches, take advice to them as I hope to play college. But other than that, I just hope everything goes well. That's what I look forward to. Now on to our Blazer, Blazer Birthday Bonanza. Bonanza. Today, September 8th, is Parker Millsap's birthday. And on September 10th, we have Miss Tanner, and on the 12th, Alyssa Duncan has a birthday. Happy birthday, guys. Okay, guys, our homecoming week is September 14th through the 18th, and our Spirit Week days are going to be, for Monday, is USA Day, so wear red, white, and blue. On Tuesday, we're having Camouflage Day and Hunter Orange Day. Wednesday is Seasons Day, so dress for your favorite season. On Thursday, it's fun in the sun. Wear sunglasses, hats, flip-flops, but no swimsuits. And Friday is Blazer Day, so wear your favorite blazer wear. Also, on Spirit Week, we're going to have some special events. On Tuesday, instead of the ice cream drop, we'll be having the pancake flip. We will flip pancakes off the roof during lunch, and you can pay $3 to catch them. All right, on Friday, we're going to have our homecoming parade at 1.30, so make sure you guys talk to your representatives about your class floats. At 2.15, we'll have a pep rally in the gym. We're going to have home soccer and volleyball games from 4.30 to 7, so make sure you guys come support the teams. And to end the night, we're going to have our high school barn party at the EB's Barn. It costs 8 at the door, so make sure you show up for music, the mechanical bowl, food, and fun. Go Northland! When we say red, you say black. Red. Red. Black. red. red. Black. When we say trail, you say blazers. Trail. Blazer. Blazers. Trail. Blazers. <laughs> this week we have no home games. <laughs> but that doesn't mean you guys shouldn't still come and support our teams. Also, remember to turn in your NHS applications this Friday. So that's about it for this week. But first, did you hear about the guy whose left side was cut off? No. <laughs> well, he's all right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyways, I'm at Mayor Bristray. And I'm at Grace Dunn 8. We'll, we'll see, see you next week, Northland. Northland.